Hi guys, welcome to Tech Based. In this video, we're going to talk about the latest Windows 11 Insider preview build for the better channel, which is the build 22635.4367. In this video, we have a smaller better channel build, but that has a new interesting feature that we're going to cover in this video. And I'm also going to show you how to enable that new feature in this video. So if you enjoy videos like these, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the Tech Based channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. So let's begin with the video. First of all, Mark stuff is adding the ability to share directly to apps that support sharing in Windows when right clicking on local files in File Explorer or on the desktop. I have here on the desktop a file. If I'm going to right click on it in this build, we're going to have, of course, the send to my phone option, which is something from older builds and also share with. And you have phone link if you want to share with your phone, mail, and also more options, which is going to open up the share section in Windows. Unfortunately for me, it's not working properly. As you can see, it's crashing, but hopefully Microsoft will fix this in a later build and of course depending on the apps that you have installed we're going to be able to share using whatsapp of course other email clients and so on to enable this new feature of course you're going to need vive tool so you can follow some of my previous videos in which i showed you how to set up vive tool but after you have vive tool set up you can go inside cmd run it as administrator and inside cmd you're going to have to type in vive tool slash enable slash id 45286384 for the first id and also we have a second id 52800817 these are basically the two IDs that you have to enable. Of course, the ID and command was discovered by Phantom Ocean 3. So make sure to follow him on Twitter if you want to learn more about these new features in Windows 11. There is also an additional ID that you can enable, Vivetool slash enable slash ID if these don't work. 4843-3719, of course, press enter. And after each command, you should receive the message successfully set feature configuration. Of course, you're going to have all these IDs and commands in the article below. So you can copy and paste them from there. And of course, thank you to Phantom of Earth on Twitter for providing the IDs for this feature. So if you're on the latest better channel build, don't forget to check it out. Right click on a file on the desktop. I'm going to have all these options or even on the file explorer. For example, let's right click on an image and then we're going to have share with and you can see here we have snipping tool, phone link, paint, mail, feedback hub and more options. Other than that, in this latest better channel build, we have some fixes. For example, related to the start menu, max a fixing issue that was leading to some insiders potentially seeing unexpected amount of spacing between items in the start menu or apps list. Related to live captions, Microsoft fixed an issue causing live captions to crash on launch for some insiders in the last two builds. And related to the taskbar, Microsoft fixed an issue where if you had multiple windows open for a nap on your taskbar, pressing win plus multiple times wasn't cycling between the windows, for example, pressing win plus one. And also fixed an issue for uncombined taskbar users where app icons were unexpectedly showing instead of the windows icon next to the window name. So basically, this is all there is to it to the latest better channel build. You can check out the article below for more information or the official Microsoft blog post. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future authors like this one. I was your man from TechBase. Until next time, have a nice day.